Aubrey Aquino recently got to chat with Mayor Daryl Steinberg about the Safe Credit Union and Performing Arts District right here in Sacramento. Take a look. Safe Credit Union is making a 25-year commitment in downtown Sacramento with an investment in the Safe Credit Union Convention and Performing Arts District. Here to tell us more about this transformative project, we have Mayor Daryl Steinberg, Safe Credit Union President and CEO David Roten, and well, uh, Visit Sacramento President and CEO Mike Testa. Welcome to the show. Thank Good. you for being here Thank this you Monday. Nice you, a lot of exciting stuff going on in Sacramento in general, particularly downtown has a lot. There's so much growth. And now we have the Safe Credit Union Convention and Performing Arts District. Mayor, how exciting is this and what does this mean? Well, it's incredible. I mean, two, 2020 is going to be a, a great year for Sacramento because the theater will be up and running by December, the convention center by November. And I'm just very appreciative of the mayor that we have good corporate partners, great corporate partners like Safe Credit Union, Dave Roten. And we've got a visit Sacramento led by Mike Testa that is really helping transform uh, our city and our region as a destination city and region. Um, it's a great time for Sacramento. Yes, we have our challenges, but um, people are really excited about it. And in part, it's because we're making the investments mm -hmm. that uh, people I know want us to make so that uh, we, we become a, a destination city and that increases our tax base it attracts a lot more art and culture and vitality, and um, these are real signature uh, investments, and 2020 is going to be the year. Well, I think anybody that visits the area or lives here has definitely noticed. I mean, I know visitors all the time are like, yeah, Sacramento is really growing. There's a lot of good stuff going on. Dave, why did SAFE decide to invest in downtown? So, you know, what's uh, really amazing about this year is it's our 80th anniversary in providing financial services to the residents and businesses in the Sacramento region. And so what better way to celebrate that milestone than to invest in these new world-class arts, entertainment, and convention venues? And I thought it was critically important to support the mayor in his effort to drive growth, job growth, and uh, economic development in the downtown area. Wow, and Mike, um, when we talk about all this growth and how exciting it is in the tourism and entertainment industry, because you work with Visit California, what's the buzz? You know, we compete against cities across the country, so every year when we go to trade shows and we talk about the convention center, they wanna know what's new, and for the last 22 years, not much has been new. Mm -hmm. So it's a completely different story now when we're on the road, when we get to show the artist renderings of what the building will be, and you know, in, in our business, people want new, and they want fresh, and they want high tech, so to be able to talk about that with potential conventioneers coming to town has made a big difference. We have the building booked years out. We have business in there as far out as 2028, and a big part of that is because the building is new. That's very exciting. I'm sure they're all watching around the country, and, and it's really good stuff for Sacramento, right, Mayor? And when is this all, what's the timeline here? Well, you know, how soon is this all going to well, take Well, again, place? it's, it's uh, <coughs> December for the theater, and the theater, by the way, is going to be state-of-the-art. Mm -hmm. I mean, the, the sound and the visual um, is something we're really going to be proud of. And uh, that's December. The convention center expansion, which is also going to be, I think, iconic, should be uh, November. And let me just say, these two investments, in addition to the Memorial Auditorium, are just the beginning. We now are putting $50 million into transforming the old Sacramento waterfront. Of course, we have the rail yards with the Major League Soccer Stadium right. yes. and housing and uh, the new Kaiser uh, facility and, and a, and a state-of-the-art courthouse. And so uh, when you look at all that and the Crocker expansion, this is a, an incredible time. And we just have to keep taking the momentum and then saying, okay, what are we going to do next for our city and our region? True, true. It is such an exciting time. So much going on. Dave, SAFE has the naming rights. Mm -hmm. um, what else does this partnership entail for you guys? So this truly is a partnership with the City of Sacramento and SAFE Credit Union. And in addition to being able to put our name on those beautiful new buildings, we're excited to be able to serve the nearly 6,000 city employees with our financial health and wellness programs and uh, we also have a new treasury relationship with the city where the city will place funds with safe that we can then lend right back into the city of sacramento and um, that, that's great news i mean safe definitely making its partnership known with the city of sacramento putting it out there um, that's awesome so when we talk about i guess the state or even the entire country mike is this going to put sacramento on the map 
Well, I would say that Sacramento already is on the map with mm -hmm. everything that's happening, and the mayor touched on this. You know, tourism in this region brings three billion dollars into our economy. So the investment that that Safe makes isn't about the tourists. It's about investing to drive outside dollars into the market, and that benefits the people who live here. So, you know, people think of Las Vegas or New York when you think of tourism, but there's more than 15 million visitors that come to Sacramento every year. So it's big business, and it's driving revenues that, again, is benefiting the people who live here. Oh, that's so exciting. Mayor, I know you're excited. Um, I would just like to know from you, um, you know, how important is this to you personally that this is coming to fruition? Well, it's a huge deal. Um, both economically, but also just to continue to elevate the vibrancy of our city. It's a new era in Sacramento. We know we've long been a, a traditional capital city and a government town, and we're proud of the fact that we're the center of public service. But one thing is clear, the people of Sacramento want us to be even more than that now. And tourism and ensuring that this is a destination city is a big part of it. And by the way, when we create and enhance these industries, that means more jobs, jobs, jobs. And for our kids, especially kids in some of our disadvantaged neighborhoods, we've got to tie this growth to making sure that the growth is always inclusive. And um, it's a good time to be mayor. You know, I was Senate leader during the terrible recession. That wasn't as much fun as it is to be mayor during <laughs> well, We're glad during you're having fun. Fun, so, fun, is fun is good. We're all about fun, fun here. Fun in a good way. Yeah, thank you. All right, well, Mayor, Dave, Mike, thank you for all for being here and telling us about this exciting project. We can't wait to see it. Thank you. Thank you, thank you Aubrey. For more information, visit safecu.org slash district.